Hey, hello everybody, my name is BRP and welcome back to another video. And today we're not in Space Engineers. No, people, this is Elite Dangerous. It's a game I've been dying to play and I finally got around to, um, to, to buy it and to play it. Um, if you don't know what this game is, it's a, uh, yeah, like an MMO. And um, the depths of this game, they made, uh, they recreated our own galaxy so I can show you that right now if we go to the galaxy map you can see all these little dots these are systems you can go to it's a 3d map that's the amazing thing about it and this is not as far as you can zoom out no by far no I can keep zooming out and zooming out and zooming out and that's the whole damn galaxy people our own damn galaxy that's how amazing this game is it's just it got it got our own galaxy and what do you do well that depends on what you want to do you can be a pirate you can uh, be bounty hunter you can trade you can do all sorts of illegal stuff I don't know it's just up to you um, right now I'm flying in another an adder I don't know how you pronounce it it's uh, not this the, the first ship you start off in it's uh, one you can buy and I had enough money to do so so I did um, what we now need to do because I picked up a mission is fly to another uh, what's it called starport to drop off some uh, information of some sort I don't know it told me in the description of the thing. Oh, we don't even have the cargo here. Weird. Okay. We can go then. Let's return to the landing gear. Oh gee. I have no clue why it's being that poppy, the noise. I'm sorry if your ears are now deaf, but yeah. Okay, what we now gotta do is we have to fly towards that other system, and we have to make a uh, a second jump because the system is too far away for me to jump it in one t uh, time. So we first gotta go out of the mass lock. You can see it right there when the blue square is. Yeah, like this, turns off, we can charge our the frameshift drive, of course. And uh, basically what it is, I believe it's a warp drive. You can compare it to that. It's not light speed, I think. Or it is, I don't know. But it's amazing, look. Uh, this can be a little bit glitchy and... Uh, yeah, it's it's it has to load a lot of things uh, for in order to get to the other system, I think. So that's why it's uh, jittering sometimes. But overall, this just looks amazing. And then this, the first time I saw that, it literally scared the crap out of me. Because damn, that thing puts you close to a goddamn sun. Like people, what are you thinking? He's not funny. Ah, there's the system we need to go to. Couldn't find it. Why are you slowing down? Charts. That's so annoying. If you get too close to a, a star or a planet, it just slows down on its own. We go. Okay. Um, yeah, guys. But um, this is something I like to uh, play more on this channel. So, if you like to see more of Elite Dangerous, if you want to play it with me, because it's an online multiplayer all around the world game. That's a little star. 
Oh shit. No, no, no. Uh, fuck. Why? What? Okay, that's weird. Apparently I got too close to the get little star. What? Escape factor? What the fuck is an escape factor? Oh shit, I'm overheating. Ah. Come on, go, 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 go! Phew! Okay. Man, that's scary. Let's get away from that thing. Yeah, I know! Just shut it and cool down. Uh, there's smoke coming off my screens. That's not good. Well, yeah, okay, this kind of stuff can happen too. Um, wow. Yeah. But before I got interrupted so rudely, uh, what I was saying is if you like to see more of Elite Dangerous, if you want to play it with me and uh, explore the galaxy, whatnot, hunt some pirates, I don't know. If you want to do that with me, you can. Add me as your friend on here. I'm just Beater MP as always. Uh, we have to go to that thing, okay. And uh, yeah, let me know if you want to see this more on the channel, because I definitely want to do it. Wait. We are here, right? Or did I go to the... Did I go to a throng? Uh oh. Now I gotta check. Did I go to the wrong system? No, I didn't. So why can't I not find. System map. I don't know. Why can I not find the thing? Is that it? Why can't I find... Oh here, there it is. E okay. Let's speed up again. That's weird, why didn't it show up in the navigational tab? Or am I just blind? Could be the case. shit did it no we didn't well I don't know okay um, what we got to do now is we have to go because uh, this is so it can be a little bit tedious if you have, don't know what you're doing the first time I did it I couldn't figure out how to get to the another station that's the weird thing but basically what you have to do is you have to travel at a certain speed and be a certain distance away from the uh, from your targets in order to uh, drop out the super cruise which I'm in right now and be able to get there so what you have to do is you have to uh, yeah align your speed in a certain rate that you don't get too close too fast but you, you don't want to slow down as much because then you will never get there that's a crazy thing. So, as you can see over there, down there, I have yeah, there is a distance and a speed thing, and uh, that line. Oh shit! Really? And this can happen too. Holy fuck! Somebody's trying to. Damn it! Oh no! We managed to escape. Ha! Okay. <laughs> yeah, apparently some dude tried to get me uh, out of Super Cruise to probably fight with me. Don't know why, because I don't have any cargo or I am not wanted in any certain way, so... 
but yeah you have to get into a certain distance and speed like I have right now and then you drop out the, the super cruise like this and uh, you're close to the thing but that's not all because if I try to dock right now then they'll probably shoot me down because what you need to do is ask permission Nice. That can also be a little bit tedious because uh, whenever there are a lot of people around, uh, yeah, the, the ship of uh, some stations are just overcrowded just because they are uh, in a popular system, you know. And these uh, stations only have three docking ports. So if you have uh, nine people waiting there, yeah, you can figure out yourself that's gonna be annoying because you'll have to wait some time uh, let's deploy the landing gear landing gear deployed nice and, and this is also a thing people find very hard to do apparently but if you just take it slow like in space engineers you just Cut like that. I really don't get why people think it's so hard. Okay, we're entering the hangar. And do the starport service. And then we'll just... Uh, yeah, deliver the goods. So we get to go to the bulletin board. That's basically uh, the job market. You could call it that. And uh, this is also the place where you uh, get your jobs and uh, go to when you, yeah, like we now have to give your cargo or information this time. Okay, yeah, and this basically tells what's happened uh, to my reputation and uh, yeah, the effect on the community. And apparently, it had some good stuff on the community, economic, uh, economic wise. Okay, guys. Um, yeah, I think that's gonna be it for today. So, like I said, if you like this, if you want to see more of Elite Dangerous, let me know down in the comments because. I lo personally love this game and I want to do more of it but if you don't, guys don't like it then of course it's not something I'm, I'm gonna force you to watch so yeah uh, if you got the game yourself come play with me I love to uh, be able and chat with uh, some guys because that also sounds very amazing because they have some sort of filter over it uh, through the game itself and it's just amazing but um, yeah uh, my outro is just way too long now but okay uh, thanks for watching my name is BRMP and I'm out PEACE